Hey, it's Jay, and today I just want to make a video comparing lead acid batteries to lithium ion, give you the pros and cons. A little over two years ago, I made a video with the Hands for Hire golf cart. We did some basic maintenance. We checked tire pressure. We lubricated different things in the cart so it didn't squeak. We washed the cart and we checked the batteries. And at that time, I had lead acid batteries in here. And after each little maintenance thing, we took the cart for a test drive and we had it run down a 100 meter stretch and we checked the speed to see what maintenance items actually impacted the speed. It turns out that tire pressure was the main factor that affected the speed of the cart. That's what made us go fastest. Since then, about six months ago, we upgraded to lithium ion batteries. We went with Reliance. It's a really good brand. We've definitely noticed some performance improvements in the cart. And I just wanted to do a pros and con list of comparing lead acids to lithium ion. So let's do it. <laughs> now since tire pressure is a big deal, I'm just gonna check on all of our tires real quick. That one is good. So the first thing I would say as one of the pros for lithium is the maintenance. The lead acid batteries, you have to constantly monitor the levels of the distilled water in the battery cells itself. If they go down too far, then you could really damage the battery. Lithium ion is just plug it in, have a charge. So in that regard, uh, lithium ion is much, much better, much easier to use. In another comparison, I feel that lithium ion gives a little bit better acceleration. When you punch the pedal down, it really, pushes the cart a little bit faster than lead acid. That one's good. Now comparing the longevity of the two, lead acid batteries will last about five years on the dot. The data shows that no matter how good the battery is, lead acid's gonna give you five years and then you gotta replace it. Now the lithium ion, some manufacturers claim that they're gonna last up to 15 years, which would be absolutely amazing. I did a bunch of research and since lithium ion is a fairly new technology and there hasn't been widespread data collected, we really don't know. Manufacturers think they're gonna last 15 years, but time will tell, we don't know yet. But it'd be nice if they lasted 15 years. Now I hope they would last that long because to be honest, lithium ion batteries are super expensive. And if we look at lead acid, you can get a new set of lead acids probably for $800 to $1,000. And these new batteries we just put in here, these Reliance, they cost us $3,300. More than three times the costs of lead acid. So you'd hope they would last three times the time. All right, tires are good, let's test it out. Final run, clean cart, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, punch it. All right, here we go. Three, Three two, two, one, one punch out. So here are the stats for the lead acid battery that we collected a couple years ago. And here are the stats for the lithium ion trials that we ran today. So you tell me, is it worth the cost to go with the lithium ion battery? Leave me a comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe this video. Until next time.